you for watching Here We Go. I decided to take a quick trip down to the Atlanta RV show. It is a huge indoor uh, RV show. And I did this last year and I went through quite a bit last year. This year, I'm just going to show you some of my favorites that I run into. And uh, it's not going to be as long as it was last year, but what a great RV show this is. And I just decided to just come down here and have a good time. So let's take a look. All right, this is a 30-foot Solomon. There's where the outdoor TV would go. And this side, it pops out that we got all these awnings above us. So let's head on up here. And this is what blows me away, is this room right here. This is unbelievable. You have your sitting area there, which is really, really comfortable. You got your couch and you got your two chairs, the recliners right there. That's where your TV would go. You got an island that has a sink and there you go. There's your stove with a full kitchen. Also a microwave up there. Back here, you come into the master with a full master, a laundry hamper right down there. And, let me see if I can do this. There you go, storage underneath, comes back down. You got a closet there and on both sides of the bed with storage up on top. And then here, this is the bathroom. You got your full bath with shower, which is nice with the skylight and all the way down. And then your commode right there. The only thing I really don't like with this is that vent. You have to be really careful water doesn't get sliding in there. But that's it. This is pretty nice. We're going to head on up. It has an outside refrigerator. And as you go straight down this way, got another entrance for the bedroom. This is the Dutchman 27 foot. This is the price. Show the show price. Thirty-six thousand. And we're gonna head up on in. But if you come up here, right away you come into the sitting area where you can have your food, kitchen, and uh, over here is bunk beds, and they're very roomy. I got in it. It fits me. I'm six foot. And then you have your bathroom that is real nice over here. You come back around this way, you got your kitchen. Look at that, very nice. With an oven and a microwave. Full set of refrigerator there and freezer. You got your TV up on top and you got a little, I guess, you know, fireplace down there. Over on this side, you do have your couch right beside where you sit and eat. And then you can go right back here into the bedroom, which has lots and lots of storage. You come down this way, and you got all that on the other side. This door slides. And it's very nice. I'm very impressed with this way Coleman has come up with this and it's really comfortable this here is the salem forest river it's brand new now right here right away you have an outside grill or griddle i should say and a refrigerator and that's where your tv would be mounted right there so what's nice about this and i like about this you go up in here very nice and you have a really nice sitting area oh like that that's really nice and then in the back you got your bunk beds and here's your kitchen and look at that right there you got a fireplace and that's where you mount your tv up there and back here, you have your master. And you got everything 
and you can even mount a TV, I believe, right here. Then, but what I like about this is this feature right here. The bathroom. You can enter the bathroom from outside. And this is a decent bathroom with a fairly big shower. And then you can head in and out right here. This is really cool. You got to check this out. It's small. You got the front here. You got the inside area. You can pretty much take this everywhere. It's great. And you got an outside griddle. But look at this inside. You come in here, you got your whole sitting area and a port to charge everything and plug in. You come in here. Now this turns into a bed. But look at this. You got an indoor fireplace, air conditioner, and you mount your TV right over there. And you have all this right here. Let me show you the outside. As you come around this side right here, you got your outdoor kitchen, refrigerator and everything. Not bad. Pretty cool. Look at this. This here is a Coleman and it's a it's nice, not a bad price, 83,000. Wow. This is pretty nice. Let's go right back to the bedroom. This is the master. This is a slide out. Very nice. And here is the bathroom with a nice shower. Sink. There you go. Over on this side, you can add a TV for the master. There's all the cabinets and everything. Really nice. Then you head out this way and you got your kitchen with a full microwave. Got your sitting area right here. And up here, you have a sleeping area with a pull-out swing arm TV. And then the driving is with a Chevy. Very nice. All right. I wanted to take a look at this one real quick. This is very nice. I like this. That's the show price right there. 113000 You come up here. And you got your kitchen right off the bat with microwave, stove top, sink, right here. You have a pull out to give you a little extra counter space. And you got your driver's seats right here with a tray that folds out for you to swivel back around that chair. All right, now you have your two beds. And that can be made into one bed. You got your TV up here. All the storage on both sides right here. All the way around. And this tilts up so you can lay here and watch TV if you wish. Down here you can see that it's for a table that comes in here. And this also turns into a full bed. Back here you got all your storage right here and you got a full wet bath right here which is fairly roomy and really nice i was pretty pretty surprised with this let's head on back out see what else we find well here's another one from winnebago this is really nice that's the price on this one. Sit on in, you're gonna like this. 
for one, you can sit outside and turn the TV around and watch it from outside. And you got this long awning that covers everything. Let's go it in. All right. This here's your couch and your two front seats. A table will go in there and that seat will turn around. And then you can be able to watch the TV from in here. Over on this side, you have the refrigerator, freezer, and microwave. You have your burner on this side. You got your sink and all your storage underneath and above. Over on this side here, well, we'll go back here first, show the sleeping area. You can make this into one big long bed or it can be two separate ones. You can see that the back of it tilts up so you can easily sit in here and watch TV from the back end. And you got all your storage that is real nice in the top and you got storage underneath also. Now, we got our hanging clothes closet right here with all the storage underneath. And over here, we have, over here, we're gonna go into the restroom. This is the full restroom, wet bath, very nice. Everything looks real nice in here. And we're gonna head on out. Right this way. Wow, I can't afford this, but boy, this is impressive. Look at this motor coach. It's so big, can't even fit it on my thing, but look at all this storage underneath. You have tons and tons of storage. An outside TV, all these pullouts, and it goes all the way back there. Let's take a look in the inside. All right, let's head on in here. Boy, this is like the old motor coaches that I used to travel in when I'd be on the road, but not like this. This is extremely nice. Look at this here. Wow. And there's a pop-up TV right there. Comes right out. You come back here. You have the kitchen right here and a dishwasher down below. Look at that. Microwave oven on top. Then you have a sitting area to eat and your pull-out. Plus also, you do have a TV right above there too. So let's head on back here. You got the refrigerator and look at this bathroom. This is a half bath in the front. And then we have back here, the master. Beautiful, beautiful. And then a TV on this side. Look at this refrigerator real quick. This is beautiful. And then we come back here and you have a full bathroom. Look at this shower. And this all right here, double sink. It's beautiful with a bathroom and all this storage. So let's head on back out. This is a beautiful coach. Head right out this way. All right, this one's 23 feet. I really like this one. It's beautiful. This is the outside of it. Then you head on inside. And look at this here. This is... And then you got this little cool sitting area over here with the Murphy bed right here that folds down into a full bed. You come back here and you got a very nice bathroom. Very nice. On this side, you got your refrigerator. Nice. Very nice, a lot of counter space, cooking, 
You got your uh, oven uh, microwave up on top, TV right there. I think it's a very nice uh, couch. Let's head on. All right, rent me. Look at this. I'm going to show you this van here. You can rent this van, and this gentleman right here. Hey. There he is. There I He's going to tell me all about this, and then we're going to take a look at this. So we have uh, camper vans, class B's, and travel trailers for rent, uh, scamper RV rentals. Uh, this is a 136 wheelbase ProMaster. It's a Thor Scope. We also have a couple of sequences, uh, also by the manufacturer Thor. Uh, this one will seat four and sleep four. It's got a pop top awning, pretty much loaded and ready for any adventure. Actually, the pop top's super cool. It's sleep two up there two down below although it's a tight down below but uh if you like to snuggle it works out well uh but it's got refrigerator stove uh pretty much loaded and ready for any road trip so well, we have several different vehicles to look at let's go and take a look at this go check it out all right you can see that the chairs in the front swivel around and they are able to work off the table also that folds around right here that covers this whole section <laughs> okay then we're gonna go up top first you climb up here through this ladder it takes you up to the top for a nice sleeping area all up there it's very nice you have some charge ports right there it's better than you have storage on this side all right down here we have a kitchen and your refrigerator is right there. Got this all right here. You got a wet bath on this side, which is nice. And then you got your sleeping area. That is kind of small, so you'd probably, if you're six foot like me, would want to sleep at the very top. But this is beautiful. To be able to rent this and take this out, this is nice. So David, yeah, I like this van a lot. Thank you. Please tell me, uh, what does this rent for? So this rental right here starts at two nineteen a night. We do a hundred free miles per day. So if you rent it for two nights, that's three hundred free miles. So additional mileage is only thirty five cents a mile. Uh, hundred mile packages, thirty five dollars each. Uh, it comes fully loaded with your propane and your water and. Really, it's everything just kind of, ready to go. Everything ready to go. Just and you in. guys are located all over. Uh, actually, we just have locations in Atlanta and McDonough, which is south of Atlanta for right now. But uh, we're looking to uh, to do world domination here real soon. Franchising, right? Yeah, maybe, or we'll keep it all <laughs> ourselves. <laughs> you got it. I love this. Thank you very much for letting us know everything here, and thank I appreciate you. it. All right, thank you. Thank you. All right, this R pod caught my attention. It's pretty cool. Out here would be some sort of hookup for a grill or something, or TV maybe. But um, this is the price on this. And then uh, you come on in here, and this is a Murphy bed right here, which isn't that bad. It was pretty comfortable when I sat down on it. You got your sink and your cooking right there. Closet space up there. Down below, you have your microwave. You got your fridge right there. And then on this side, you have everything, your place to sit to eat. You got your TV up there. Then you come back here and you got your closet on this space, toilet, and shower. Pretty nice, not bad. We're going to head on back out. Look at that. They have the map too. I like that. That's for you to travel and mark off every place you've been to. Let's head out. All right. I wanted to show you this one real quick. I really like this. Actually, it's sold. Henry, Henry bought it. And um, let's get a good look at this. And in the back here, they actually have a whole outside kitchen area. And then inside, you go on in here. And you got a sitting area that also turns into a bed. 
But look at that, windows in this thing. If you don't feel claustrophobic in this, this is very nice. On this side, you have your microwave oven and you got your fridge. And then over here, you got your whole inside cooking area. But look at this sink. Look at the size of this sink. Unbelievable, very nice. You have your TV that swivels out and you have your bed area, which again has windows to make it feel real roomy. And then here, which I'm pretty impressed. This thing is built really well. Oh, there I am. But in here, you got your wet bath, which I think is really well done. Very nice and well lit too. Let's head back out. All right, here's a really small version of the one we just seen. And this one here, you go in. Nice little area over here. Look at that window. You got a nice view. And then you got your sleeping area with the TV and everything right here. And air conditioning. Very cool, but this is what really impresses me. You can take this off road. You can go and have a really good time wherever you want. But look at this kitchen. Outstanding. And again, this company makes it to where you got a deep dish sink. Everything you need right here. What would a home show be without an Airstream? A very expensive Airstream. Look at this. Here it is. Let's head in and take a look at this. Wow. Pillows thrown everywhere, but boy, is this nice. I should have came in and straightened out the pillows. They don't pay me enough. All right, here we go. Look how nice this is. You got your refrigerator right here. Let's head back here. This is what I like about Airstreams. For one, they're really roomy as far as, you don't feel claustrophobic. They have plenty of room. They have uh, windows everywhere. The, the material and everything is just well built. And uh, as we come back out this way, look at this bathroom. This is a shower. This is only a shower right here. And then the bathroom is on this side. And this is beautiful. Very nice. Separate. I like it. Let's head on back out. Boy, this thing is an eye catcher right here. It's called the Barefoot. And let's go ahead and take a look. I wanted to show you this. This is beautiful, it has a little window in the back. Let's head on in. You come on in and there is the kitchen. Wow, now this thing is small, but it is very, very nice. And over here is where you have the sitting area, sleeping area for, uh, for where you, you know, you're, you're gonna sleep. And then right here, we got cabinets. Very, very well lit in here. Beautiful. But this bathroom is very, very nice. It's a wet bath, of course. It's, but look at that. It has its own little sink. It has the toilet right there. and has storage right behind the toilet. Very nice. And then this door just slides very close. And very, very cool. Let's head on out. All right, look at this. This is amazing. And I'm really impressed with this. I have someone here that's going to explain this whole thing. Actually, she invented this whole thing. Go Hi, on. I'm J.A. Huddleston, the inventor of the Go Shelter. I invented it because of spending a whole lot of time in the ring myself, backpacking and on the side of a soccer field taking pictures. So I invented this. I wanted it to be hands-free, when it all be adjustable. You can open it up to allow more airflow in. You can shut it down down whenever the weather's nasty. Have a bunch of adjustments. You can keep on moving. I have ducktail edges here, 
so that the water runs to the sides instead of off the front in front of you. It's all PU coated fabric that keeps it all waterproof. And then on the back, I have a little duct tail so the water shoots off the back. Let's so it doesn't take a run look at that. Look at that. I head. see that. Well, I was having such a good time. I, I spent way too much time there. I didn't expect to do that much filming and my battery went dead. And I am so sorry. But I wanted to take the time to show you the website. And I will put a link of the website up here. And I wanted to say that I was so impressed with this shelter that this woman designed and came up with. She was the inventor for this shelter. And uh, I wish her the best of luck with it. I think it's amazing. And I, I want to show it to you right here. This thing is made in America. I love it. And if you're hiking, especially for day hikes, I think it's um, great for uh, hiking and doing what I do. As far as if I'm out and it starts raining and, and uh, I'm doing some filming. So anyway... Uh, there it is right there. You can get online and take a look at it. And, um, I wish her the best of luck and I want to thank you for watching. Here we go. I had such a great time at the Atlanta camp and RV show. And, um, if you haven't subscribed, please do. I appreciate it. And thanks for watching. See you next time.